Morning guys, it's Sunday 6th. How are you today? This has to be one of my favorite titles for a live I've ever written. <laughs> Perfectionism is just fear wearing lipstick. Yeah guys, listen to that one. Think about it, really think about it. I get it, I get you want perfect. I get you want it to be the best you've ever done, the best version of yourself. Um, but who defines perfect? Who the hell even knows what perfection is? Secretly, if you really think about it, now let, let's do a why exercise, okay? You perfectionists out there, you want it to be perfect. Okay, 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 okay. And you're not gonna do it until it's perfect. I get it. Why do you want it to be perfect? Because, you know, it's, it's, uh, it's something I've done and it's, uh, you know, it's a representation of me. And you're perfect, right? No, I'm not saying that I'm perfect. I'm just saying this. I want it to be right. I want it to be, I want it to be really good. You know, I want, it to be the, I want it to be the best it can be. And what will happen if it's not perfect? Well, you know, people might not like it or it might not be really good. And why will that matter? Because then that means people might think less of me or they might not like me. And why will that matter? Well, that'll mean I won't be accepted, or I won't be loved. Really, behind perfectionism is just fear, and that's okay. I'm scared. You're scared. Everybody's scared sometimes. It's okay. But if you try and wait for something to be perfect, you're really just procrastinating. You're never going to do it. And plus, when you think you hit perfect, it's going to move immediately. It's just fear. And that's okay. That's why I like doing lives. Scary. Bloody scary. You don't know who's watching, who isn't watching. Nobody's watching. Nobody cares. You care, I care, who cares? I look like an idiot, I look like a fool. But this is why I love doing live because it's not perfect. I'm not perfect. I might say something wrong. I might mess it up. I might fall flat on my face. I might have somebody throw something at me right now. And everyone would see it. And then I'd be embarrassed. And then I'd look horrendous. And that'd be real. That'd be honest. Guys, in a life of goddamn filters and chasing and you know volume perfection and trying to push it out into the world and promoting everything that's wonderful and none of the bad stuff, it ain't true, guys. And it's stopping people from living their best life. Stopping people from just doing shit. Just doing the stuff that you want to do. But you're waiting for perfect. Perfect is not going to come. Your ducks are not going to get in a row. They're never going to be in the right place. I want to wait till the kids are a little bit older. I'm going to wait until I finish this year. I'm going to wait until Monday. I'm going to wait until we've got enough money in the bank. It's never going to happen. It's not going to be perfect. I know you're just scared. I'm scared too. Yeah? I put a video out this morning for my training and my coaching and stuff like that. It is not a perfect video at all. I know I messed about with it a little bit and I even caught myself because before you can coach anybody else, you must first be able to coach yourself. Before you can lead anybody else, you must be able to lead yourself. And I caught myself when I was doing it and I was like, why do you keep pissing about with this video? Why do you keep messing about? Can you help people? Yes. Do you help people? Yes. Well, do people agree with you though? Yeah, you know, I've got reviews, referrals, evidence, helping people. Right, so if you know you can do it, just show people, just tell people. Don't worry about making it the glossiest, most perfect, most, oh my God, look how incredible it is. Don't worry about that. Yeah, just be honest, just be open. That's what people want. People want you, the person that's watching. Whatever you want to do, the thing that you have, the gift you were given, the value that you add to the world, but you're not giving it to the world because you're waiting for it to be perfect, it is not going to be perfect. Stop waiting for perfection because the pillars are always moving, the factors are always moving, nothing's staying still. It's not going to be perfect because as soon as you try and put it in the bullseye, the bullseye has moved. The world has moved on. Just be you. Just do it today. Just start, whether it's asking that person out, whether it's starting that business. I've got a friend of mine, one of my clients. He has got some awesome ideas, one in particular, 
and he's very passionate about it and he speaks with such great inspiring articulate words but he's waiting for it to be perfect he's waiting for all of his ducks to be in a row problem is every time he puts another duck in the row he invents another duck that's not there oh well i need to wait for this now i need to wait for that now it's gotta be perfect guys it ain't gonna be don't pretend you're waiting for perfect when really you're just scared to death the world is gonna laugh at you when you raise your hand and go I like doing this, I like doing that, I want to start this thing, I feel like I want to improve my mind, and improve my body, I want a better job, I want a better house, put your hand up and ask, and you might be astonished at what the world will give you if you just put your hand up and say, I need some help, and anybody tell me which direction I should be going in, and they'll go, hey! I'm glad you asked. He's left. Magic. Thank you very, very much. You're scared to death. Somebody will go, what, you don't know where you're going? No, I don't know where I'm going. All right, I'm asking for help. Don't worry about being perfect. Don't worry about how you appear to the rest of the world all the time. Just be you. Right. Time to go and get after it. I will see you tomorrow. This was... Five, ten minutes of your life, you're never going to get it back. I hope you found some value from it. If you do need some help, you want to talk about something, drop me a message. You know, I speak to people every day, they're not clients. People that just took something from a message, and they're worried about something, they want to talk about something, reach out. If I can help, I will. And if you can help me, I'm sure you'd do the same. So have a great Sunday. Spend some time with some loved ones. Don't try and make it perfect. It's never going to be a remember. Just try and enjoy yourself. And I will see you... Tomorrow! It won't be perfect, ladies.